Hey everyone, it's me back with another video and today I'm here to tell you guys about my story with consoles from when I was a little kid up until now. I'm here to tell you guys about Xbox versus PlayStation. I'm here to tell you guys about the science and technology behind the consoles. This is going to be a long video. Let's just get into it. Okay, so I'm going to start with my story. So when I was a little kid, I played the PlayStation 2 and the PlayStation 3. And then one day, the Xbox 3, well, I heard the Xbox 360 didn't just come out, but I heard about the Xbox 360 and my friends were playing it. So I wanted to get the Xbox 360 because it looked better than the consoles I already had. So I got the Xbox 360 and I loved it and I played it for years and years until the Xbox One came out. And then I got the Xbox One and I loved that and I played it for years and years until I heard about the PS4 Pro in 2016. And I was like, whoa, that's crazy, dude. I, I really want that. And then like all my friends had PS4s and they were all showing me review videos and like just peer pressuring me. And they're like, dude, your Xbox One is like trash compared to this, dude. You need to get this. This is like the best console ever. And kids till this day in 2019 still think the PS4 Pro is the best console ever. Okay, so yeah, everyone was pressuring me to get it and it looked really awesome. So, and I, and, and I had my Xbox One for like years, you know, it was old and dusty. So like, yeah, I decided to get the brand new PS4 Pro for Christmas and I loved it. Um, and so, yeah, I played with that for a year up until 20, 2017, late 2017. Um, and I heard about the Xbox One X coming out. And uh, I just looked at all the, I just looked at everything about it. Like I researched everything about it. I watched review videos. I watched literally everything about that new console. I watched all the trailers. I watched all the reviews. I watched all the unboxings. I watched everything about that new console. And I fell in love with it. And I was like, dad, I really regret buying this PS4 Pro now. I wish I just, I would have waited and got the Xbox One S and then waited for this to come out. I, I, I really screwed up. And yeah, till this day, I still think I really screwed up because I'm still with Xbox. I still have my One X and I really wish I didn't get that PS4 Pro because I was really peer pressured into it. With this console, I wasn't peer pressured at all. This was my choice. I looked at everything myself. I, I, I just loved it. So like, yeah, I'm still with this console. The PS4 Pro, that was complete peer pressure. I just liked it because it looked cool and I haven't played on PlayStation in a while. And it, it was just such a big upgrade from the PS, the PlayStations I played back then. And I was like, whoa, this is insane. This is like the future, dude. And like people were constantly just, you know, so uh, I got that, but like that was a mistake, dude. That that was peer pressure, okay? So, yeah. And when I got the Xbox One X for Christmas, and I looked at all the technology behind it, and I, I I just I researched everything about it, okay? So I knew everything about the One X, and then I knew everything about the PS4 Pro. I compared all the stats, I watched comparison videos, all that kind of stuff, and now I'm sitting here like this console is like so much better like the ps4 pro comes close but like this is still so much better okay and i'm gonna explain to you guys why it's so much better all right everyone i'm back and i have the stats and the comparisons right here i'm gonna show you guys why the one x is better than the pro let's get into this all right the cpu xbox one x 8 custom times 86 cores clocked at 2.3 gigahertz. PS4 Pro, 8 core AMD custom Jaguar at 2.1 gigahertz. Uh, yeah, 2.3 gigahertz, 2.1, yeah. Xbox beats PlayStation on that. GPU, integrated AMD graphics with six teraflops of performance. PS4 Pro, integrated AMD Polaris graphics with 4.2 teraflops of performance. Six against 4.2, Xbox beats them again. 
RAM, Xbox One X, 12 gigabytes GDDR5, PS4 Pro, 8 gigabytes GDDR5, uh, Xbox beats him again, 12 against 8, HDD, 8, what? I don't know what HDD means. Okay, um, yeah, but uh, one terabyte, one terabyte, they're equal on that. Uh, weight, uh, 8.4 pounds Xbox One X and PS4 Pro, 7.2 pounds. And the reason, my lighting went out. Okay, the reason it, ca uh, I mean, it's, uh, the reason it's so much heavier is because they have a lot of technology packed into this, okay? They have a lot more technology packed into this little thing. So it's smaller. A lot of people call it the smallest Xbox ever, and it is, um, but it has a lot of technology in here. And it's better to be smaller, it's more compact, and it's more out of the way, you know, and it's not getting in the way of any anything. So that's good, that's good. And with the PS4 Pro, it's like bigger and like wider, and you know, it, it, it's just in the way, you know? Like it's, there's like not much of a size difference, but th this is just better because, you know, it's, it's smaller. It's not smaller by really much, but it's, you know, it, it's just smaller. So, yes, yeah, it's, it's more compact. Um, so, yeah, and then the price is $499, $499 for the 1X, and $399 for the PS4 Pro. And, yeah, the price is worth it, okay? The price is worth it because all that technology, it's, it's better, okay? It's just a better console. I just explained it to you guys, okay? Um, yeah. 8 custom times 86 cores clocked at 2.3, so 2.3 gigahertz, 2.1 gigahertz. Xbox wins that. GPU, 6 teraflops, 4.2 teraflops. See, it beats them again. RAM, 12 gigabytes. PS4 Pro, 8 gigabytes. It beats them on everything, okay? Except for that one thing where it's, it's one terabyte, but like that's just one thing where they're equal, okay? So, yeah, and... Yeah, the only thing the PS4 is really better at is the price. But, like, the price is worth it for the One X. And guys, I just figured out what HDD means. It means high definition something. I don't know what the last D means, but it, it's high definition something. So, yeah, my dad just explained that to me. I probably uh, would have figured that out if I was thinking right. Because, like, I've, I've heard HD all the time, and I, I know all about high definition and HD. You know, I, I, I see it and hear it all the time. So, like, I, I just wasn't thinking right because I'm tired right now. So, yeah, it's high definition. I don't know what the last D is, but yeah, high definition. So, let's get back into the video. All right, and for you PlayStation players, um, you guys can still play PlayStation. I'm just showing you guys the facts. Like, you guys don't have to stop playing PlayStation just because of what I said. You can play PlayStation all you want. I'm not mad at you about that, okay? Just don't come at me at school or, in, or on the internet about PlayStation is better now, okay? I showed you all the facts. I explained all the facts, okay? Do not come at me about PlayStation is better ever again, okay? I just showed you all the facts, okay? The Xbox One X is better than the PS4 Pro in so many ways, okay? I showed you everything. Don't ever come at me about PS4 Pro is better ever again, okay? Showed you the facts. Just, just don't do that anymore, okay? Play PlayStation all you want. Like, just, just don't talk trash about Xbox again around me, please. Don't talk trash and, and, and don't say PlayStation's better, please. Just don't. I will whip out those facts on you so fast. Like, don't, just don't, just don't start another conversation like that with me. Just, I will whip those facts out on you so fast. Like, just, it's so annoying, guys. It is so annoying how I get treated at school about Xbox versus PlayStation. And now here's proof that I'm right. It's like so many kids, like 30 kids on like five kids about this. Like, it's, it's so annoying. And here's the proof that us five kids are right. These five kids against these 30 kids, we're right, okay? So don't ever come at me or my friends about PlayStation is better ever again. So yeah, guys, that's it for this video. Let me know what you thought of this in the comments down below. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out. I'm going to bed. I'm tired. Good night, everyone.